Hey guys, it's me, Edward Vane, and this is Paola's newest mechanical keyboard, the F3001. This is a 1,600 peso TKL mechanical keyboard with a volume knob, and it is tri-mod, so you can actually have this wired, Bluetooth, or 2.4G dongle. Inside the box, you get, you know, extra keycaps, the dongle, of course, the, the keycap puller, and of course, the Type-C cable as well. So this is actually made out of plastic and you know it does feel a little bit light now as you can see at the back it does have a stand not a kickstand but you know just your re regular stand and yeah it's made out of plastic and it does feel a bit hollow and from the looks of it it's not RGB at all it's a single color well not actually single color there are two colors we have blue light and this you know beige or orange light and it kind of flickers so I'll just have to turn it off. So aside from it being trimod, what I also like about this keyboard is the stabs. Check this out. The stabs are actually quite good, okay? Really nice. And this is only a 1600 board. Now it's not perfect, it does need a little bit of, you know, adjusting, but the stabs are great. It's like red dragon stabs, right? I probably will mod this in a video, or maybe by the time I uploaded this video, I've already uploaded a short, but we'll see. So the volume knob adjusts the volume, and it also adjusts the lighting effects too, if you if you press it. And that's basically it. Now let's take a look at a sound test and typing test. I'm not going to show you guys the lighting effects anymore since it's only single color. I'll only do you know lighting effects if it's RGB. Before we begin our typing and sound test guys, I want you guys to know that this keyboard is actually not hot swappable. Yeah, so that does kind of suck, so keyboard enthusiasts, if you guys want to change the switches, you have to desolder the switches. Alright, now, as you can see here we have floating keycaps, so it's easier to clean, easier to take off the keycaps, and we're looking at, you know, just generic red switches. I looked at the label, it's basically... K Reds. I've had, I haven't heard of that brand before, and I can't actually look it up online. But hey, if it's not blue clicky switches, it's great. All right, so let's have the typing and sound test. Alright guys, so here are my final thoughts of this mechanical keyboard. So, 1,600 pesos, pretty solid deal, and it is tri-mod. Cool. I like these stabs as well. These stabs sound pretty nice. It reminds me of, you know, Red Dragon stabs. Cool. And of course, the volume knob. So you can actually adjust the volume and the lighting effects using the volume knob. Nice. But one thing that I really don't like, and I think what a lot of people will not like about this mechanical keyboard, is that it is not hot swappable. So for keyboard enthusiasts out there, this might be a turn off. I mean, yes, you can desolder the switches, but that's pretty much of a hassle, especially when it comes to hot swappable keyboards. You can just take the keycap off and then take the switches. If you have to desolder them, you have to take the keycaps off, unscrew it, desolder, put the keycaps you want, then solder them again, then put it all back together. It can be a little tedious, right? But I know some people like a challenge out there. Next, this isn't really a, what you call this con, it's more of a neutral. I don't like the lighting effects. I mean, there's only two colors here. It's not RGB, it's not rainbow, but just white and orange. Now there are some people out there who don't like RGB and they can just turn it off here. So that's pretty much, you know, a neutral for some. So with that said, it's not hot swappable, but it has good sound and you know the quality of this board is actually quite nice as well especially since they are floating keycaps easy to clean easy to get especially with your fingers so i'll rate this most likely a 7.8 again not hot swappable 
but it's tri-mod, it's budget friendly, it looks great, it has a volume knob, and if you guys want to buy this keyboard, shop your links below. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, please like, comment below if you have any questions on the EULA F3001, and if you guys also can, please like my Facebook page. Okay guys, bye!